Injury-wise, Rush East had a pulmonary contusion. Um, he's in stable condition. They're going to keep him overnight, but um, you know we'll pray for him. But but I think he's going to be uh, he's going to be okay. Um, have gotten good news on what we know is not something that you take lightly. Um, tough game today. I, I thought the guys battled. There was a lot of really good bright spots, a lot of chances for us to be able to come away with the result that we were hunting up, but we just came up short. Um, but really grateful for you know the resilience of this group, the way they continued to battle. We lost a lot of guys in this in this game again on both sides but you know guys that maybe have never been in positions they've been in before got opportunities to be able to play and um you know there's some things that that you look at and uh you can't help but be grateful congratulations to coach carroll and the seahawks for finding a way to be able to get it done um we'll look back on this film and and wish we had you know a couple chances to be able to make some plays that i believe our guys are capable of but we just came up short and i'm very appreciative of this group he is Yeah, I'm not thinking about that right now. Nothing's changed from kind of where we left things off on Friday. Which would be what? That I'm right here right now, and we'll deal with that stuff at a later time. Um, what is it about this process that's making you unsure at this point? Yeah, I'll talk about stuff for the, as it relates to the game. Anything as it relates to, you know, what what is going to happen with me, um, like I said, I'm, I'm not thinking about that right now. I'm appreciative of the way these guys finished up the season, and so um, any question of that nature, I'm not going to answer. Did you have a particular message to this team uh, being that it's the end of the season? Yeah, just appreciative of them, Kurt. Um, grateful for the way that they continue to battle. Um, it's one of those years that has been, uh, you know, so many different challenges, unique experiences, but guys kept swinging, they kept battling, and uh, wanted that for them to be able to finish up on the right note, but uh, they can hold their heads high with the way that they battled. You'll have to talk, you know, those are those are things that we haven't even had a chance. I mean, we just finished up the season, so we'll work through all that kind of stuff, and um, you'll have clarity on that sooner than later, I'm sure. Sean, I know you don't want to talk about it too much, but was there a point where you thought your last play, your last anything today? No. Okay. Thanks, guys. I just want to check on Russ because that's a scary phrase. Yep. Artist, do you want to be able to articulate? I mean, I kind of just found out, but I mean, he's in he's in stable condition. You know, everything. It's it's something that you don't take lightly. They'll keep him overnight. Um, but I, the the sense that I got from Reggie was that a hey, something that you you take very seriously. But he's going to be okay. I think it's probably just based on getting uh, on a flight so quickly afterwards is why they want to just keep him here. Um, you know, really just kind of standard where we'll have our exit physicals tomorrow, um, talk to the players and the coaches, and, and then keep it moving from there. Did you get hurt on a hit? I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly what occurred there. Sean, do you have any kind of timeline for your own decision on what you're, you may or may have? I, I don't. I don't right now. Okay. Thank you, guys.